Well, how about it? It's Grand Funk Railroad with their version of Gimme Shelter. A Lost 45 on Billboard's Hot 100 September 25th, 1971. It is at number 69 that week, down 8 from 60, 61. They did a respectable, respectable version of the Rolling Stones classic Gimme Shelter from Let It Bleed. Uh, Rolling Stones in 1969, very compulsive record, apocalyptic record. It saw sort of reflected a grim record, reflected the social changes that were rocking the very fabric of American society in the 60s. And then there was the unpopular war, unpopular war in Vietnam being fought overseas. Although the war was winding down by the summer of 1971 when Grand Funk Railroad came out with their song Feeling All Right. I mean, not well, they did a version of that song too off the same album, but they covered Give Me Shelter by the Rolling Stones, produced by Terry Knight. Terry Knight, who produced their first big hit record, was uh, I'm Getting Closer to My Home Late. God, I'm sure you might you remember that song. Did that song resonate or what? I can still, God, get goosebumps. I can still hear that song. The, the opening chords in my head. Late summer, early fall, fall 1970. Didn't even make top ten. And uh, the follow-ups didn't do as well either, at least not initially. They didn't go top ten again until... Oh gosh, where an American band was their next top was their first top ten, I believe. That was in nineteen seventy three. But anyway, uh, the album the album is called Survival. Oh, let me get into Terry Knight. I forgot I just got off track. Terry Knight. Terry Knight, you might remember if you're one of these uh, music aficionados or if you grew up in Michigan back in the sixties, you might remember the group Terry Knight and the Pack. They had some regional hits back in the mid to late 60s, and they did a cover. My goodness, they covered the Yardbirds, scintillating, one of their scintillating classics. Jeff Beck on guitar, Jimmy Page might have played on that session too, on the Yardbirds version. Mr. You're a Better Man Than I. If you want to hear some blues, I mean, you want to hear some uh, massive sort of a blues infusion in rock and roll, particularly the blaring guitar solo. I highly recommend that song. Give it a listen to Mr. You're a Better Man Than, than I by the Yardbirds, but also covered by Terry Knight and the Pack. By the late 60s, Terry Knight was a producer. He was a solo artist, too, at one time, but he was a producer at Capitol Records, and he he made a connection with two former Pack members of his old group. There was Mark Farner, guitarist, and also Dan Brewer, the drummer. And he told these two guys, hey, why don't you guys, let's let's make another group. You guys make another group. Add a bass player. And I think you guys, I, I could put you guys on the map if you just, we're going to make you like Cream. We're going to, you guys going to be the next Cream. Trio. And Grand Funk Railroad, born 1969. Might have been 68. They had some minor hits in 1969. And, of course, getting closer to my home. I'm your captain. God, I remember listening to that song late nights on the radio back in the day, the long version at 2 o'clock in the morning on some distant radio station. You know, those AM radio stations from 200 or 300 miles away that you can pick up at night. Well, anyway, let's go back to this record by a Grand Funk Railroad. Did not do too well on the charts, and that's not surprising. Maybe it's probably more of an album cut than a single per se. Uh, particularly their version. It peaked at number 61, and it was on Billboard's Hot 100 for six weeks. Grand Funk Railroad, their version of Gimme Shelter, on Billboard's Hot 100 of September 25th, 1971.